Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve an issue if you're looking to prevent different users from changing the time settings in Windows 10 or Windows 7 or Windows 8 for that matter. This tutorial will apply for any version of Windows 7 or Windows 8 as well as Windows 10 for the exception of Windows 10 Home Edition which does not have the local security policy ability in it. So we're just going to go ahead and jump right into it. And we're going to start by opening up the Start menu. Go ahead and type in Local Security Policy. Best match to come back with Local Security Policy here. You want to go ahead and left click on that one time. So now in the local security policy window that appears, you want to go ahead and expand local policies. So either double click on this folder or left click on the little arrow next to it to expand the drop down. Go ahead now and just left click on the user rights assignment folder one time. And now on the right side there should be something that says change the system time. So you can see that right in here. Go ahead and double click on that. And now you want to left click on where it says add user or group. At this point, you want to go left click where it says object types, and you want to check all the boxes here. So any boxes that are unchecked, you want to just select them all, left click on OK, and left click on OK one more time. Now that we're back to the select users or groups screen, you want to left click on the advanced button. Now you want to go ahead and left click on the find now button and locate the group or individuals that you do not want to have access to this ability. So let's just say you want to set that to everyone. So we're just going to scroll down to everyone right here and then left click on OK. Once you're done with that, go ahead and left click on OK. Click on OK one more time. Close out of here and that should be about it. So I do hope this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.